a lot of emphasis on defense in the fall, and the guys really bought into that, played hard, played it really well. So if I were to say going into the spring, the one thing that I would, you know, look at as a strength would be defense. Going into my senior year, I'm looking forward to this new team, new coaching staff. Got us all excited. After last year, we had some bumps in the road, but this year we've been working hard, and I'm just excited to see what kind of goals we can achieve. At first base, you know, I got two guys, Caleb Kohlmeyer, who's a returner, had a really good year last year, and then Dustin Exford from NEO. Having those two guys there, uh, you know, is, is a big addition for us. At second base, we got Cesar Rodriguez, who's transferred from NOC Tonkawa, and then Austin Colwell, who's a returner. They both bring different things to us. Both of those guys, I'm really excited to see you know, kind of what, we're gonna, what they can do this spring. At shortstop, we got Chase Knott and Johan Ochoa. Uh, Chase coming off a really good, strong summer. I think he's got the ability to be a middle of the order offensive player. And then Johan's also lined up at shortstop this fall. He's a guy that can kind of fill in, has the ability to play anywhere. We're just comfortable in the conference now. We know what to expect how to lead the younger guys and get the program going in the right direction. Third base, we got Trey Bobo, who's transferred in from Oklahoma Wesleyan, uh, was on their World Series team last year. We also got Ryan Hendricks over there. Ryan played a lot last year. I put together a really good junior season last year. So I think at third base, we're, we're covered pretty well. We were very fortunate to pick up Andrew Venisi at semester and can play either corner outfield or corner infield positions. Um, also gives us another option at the DH spot. A guy that can change the game in one swing. We had Zach Ashford lined up in right field along with Travis Pete. Zach's a transfer from East LA. Um, and he's a big time tools guy. He's you know, 6'4", can really run. He's got the best arm on the team. Uh, he's got big time power offensively. And for him, the biggest thing is just gonna be consistency. Travis is a guy that's just steady. Whenever you ask him to do something, he brings it every single day. And then in center field, we've got uh, Alex Cochran returning. Uh, he played center field most every day last year. And we also have Cameron Kirk, who's a transfer. Uh, both of those guys can run really well. Both have top end speed and cover a lot of ground out there. And both will play an exceptional center field for us. And in left field, uh, we got Blake Gibson, we got Blake Heston. Heston's going to be able to handle right handed pitchers really well. And then against tough left handers, I think you got Blake. He brings some things to, to the lineup that other guys that we have in place don't. There's going to be some tough choices for the coaching staff to make when we start writing out lineups, but you know that's what it's all about. Well, Coach Thomas has really taught us over the fall, work hard, and just let the rest fall into place. So I'd like to leave for the freshmen and underclassmen just to work hard and everything, and just that will help you reach your goals the harder you work. I couldn't ask for more from the entire group. So um, I think that everybody's earned the opportunity to go out there and compete for a position, and those guys have you know, I think they've responded and take on that responsibility.